So it is fairly early on a Thursday. It's not even Friday. It's not the weekend yet. I'm trying to get a little bit of a jump on the weekend warriors. Uh, but already I'm astonished by how many people are out here. Uh, maybe, maybe I could get a nice campsite by coming out here on Thursday, even though my friends can't come out till Friday. But uh, I don't know. I mean, I know I'll find something. It just may not be as premium as I'd hoped for. All right, this is not a bad campsite. I'm not super off the beaten path, but this is a quiet little road that not too many people go down. And uh, I've got the creek right down there. It's a really nice day here in Central Oregon. I don't have any sort of awning or anything like that yet on the truck, and so I've just rigged up uh, a sort of a shelter that I could pull back underneath. I don't know exactly what the weather may bring over the next couple of days. I think there's a chance of some showers. This is definitely not any type of permanent solution at all, and I only mess with it because I'm gonna be here for two nights. If I was only gonna be here one night, I probably wouldn't have even bothered. I do wanna figure out some kind of permanent shelter system that will come off the back of the canopy so that I've got a sheltered area over my kitchen. This robin flitted around the campsite the entire weekend. I decided to call him Christopher. Alright, I've got some firewood prepped. Now, if I could just get someone to come and build a campfire for me. You know it's going to be a good day if there's already a morning campfire when you get out of bed. So I'm glad I put the tarp up yesterday because uh, I decided to actually go ahead and rain on us here. I've added an extra line to the tarp here in the middle sort of create a valley for the rain to run off so that it doesn't cool up in there. Carrying an extra tarp is always handy. You never know when you might have a use for uh, 
a tarp. I pulled this one out to cover up the firewood to keep it dry while it's raining. You can also use uh, an extra tarp to string up some extra shelter or uh, I've used this tarp uh, when I had to get down and work underneath my car uh, so I had some protection from the ground. So really it's a, it's a cheap but super useful multi-purpose item to carry with you on overlanding trips. My longtime friends Rupert and Rich have arrived, and this is Hank. This is a pretty low-key weekend. No exploring or big adventures. I really just came out here to chill with some friends, though I took advantage of arriving early yesterday to film a quick walkthrough of the camping setup in the contractor canopy, and that video is already available on the channel. For dinner tonight, I'm going with an extremely simple yet tasty and satisfying meal. I bought some pre-cooked chili lime seasoned chicken thighs at the grocery store deli on my way out of town yesterday, and I'm simply adding it along with some chopped green onions to a packet of ramen. It's super easy to turn a 50 cent package of ramen into a delicious dinner with whatever extras you want. For some extra protein and richness, I'm mixing in an egg, which will cook quickly in the near boiling broth. Jason has a long to-do list today and is headed off into the morning mist. Here in camp, we're making coffee and breakfast, and basically continuing to rest and relax. As the sun burns off the fog, I need to think about breaking camp and returning to Eugene. Another weekend of camping in the rain wasn't what I'd hoped for, but in what is looking to be a drought year, I cannot complain about water coming out of the sky. I'll have more opportunities to see the sun. For now, it's time to air up and head home.